Now that we finally know what the C8Z06 actually looks like, we have the idea of what engine's inside, now we gotta talk about horsepower numbers. But first, before that, I'm Daniel, this is Car Cookie. It's the number one channel you're gonna be getting your car news in minutes, and honestly, it's the only channel you're gonna be getting car news in minutes. So make sure to subscribe, make sure to join the family. Again, you guys keep humbling me every time you smash these subscriber goals, so let's hit 365 by that next upload. Now let's get right into this video. And before we start this video, I do wanna give credit where credit's due for this video. I do wanna thank Don Sherman and Horsepower Obsessed for the information information on this as we finally have some concrete evidence on these horsepower numbers so thank you so much to you you know to that YouTube channel and that information as well but now let's get right into the additions of the C8 Corvette and also more specifically the Z06 as we'll be talking about the additions in different episodes so right off the bat we can see a few issues with the claims now this was updated down the road as we can see they're talking about a Grand Sport and we know there's gonna be an E-Ray but we're talking about that Z06 in this video that the E-Ray is gonna be next so with that Z06 you can see now that you should be expecting it to be closer to 675 horsepower and it's going to also be paired with 525 pound-feet of torque. Now we can really thank that naturally aspirated flat plane crank engine in it for those torque numbers and that horsepower, you know, now I really don't see how those torque numbers really could have been at 600, for example, if unless it was like turbocharged or something like that, due to it being a naturally aspirated engine. With that update as well, you can see it's gonna also be 25 horsepower more than the previous Z06 in the C7 generation. So this might be a great time for you to upgrade from that C7. You're gonna still be getting a great naturally aspirated. You're gonna be having that, that amazing high revving, and you're gonna also be getting a lot more of those stylistic cues and race inspired parts in the wider body that I mentioned in the previous video. With all this information and with everything being said and done, we should be seeing that press event this summer for those final concrete numbers and the final concrete look. But as we start inching closer and closer to the summer, we're going to keep having these leaks and they're going to be more finalized and more confirmed as we are pretty concrete on them right now. But that's all we have for this one today. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe, make sure to like the video, comment down below. Would you rather have that E-Ray? Would you rather have that extra little bit of horsepower from the electric motor as well? Or would you rather have the Z06? Let me know down below. Personally, I'd rather have the Z06. But like I said, that's all we have for this one. You guys have a great one.